What's it like owning a BMW with 250 toes miles? Let me start off by saying it's awesome. <laughs> Especially with this 2006 BMW E53. Um, as everybody knows, these trucks, well, these engines are really reliable. Um, I did get this truck specifically in the 3.0 which is the inline six. Um, I never really wanted the V8. Um, I rather choose reliability over power <laughs> because the V8s in this model are very, well, extremely unreliable in my opinion. So getting the 3.0 was definitely a must. Um, I've had this truck for about a year now. Um, I got it at 200 and I would believe a 218,000. It's currently at 241,000 right now. So, and I can count the stuff I've done to it, which is not a lot. So I just want to give you guys a little walk around of it. Hunting, this is the front. Very incredible truck, yo. Stupid reliable, yo. Stupid reliable. Hey you guys, this is original paint. Hasn't been um, repainted. Never been repainted. All original paint. Um, the rims did not come with the truck. I actually um, got these rims off of the newer version of these X5s. I think it was the E70 generation that these rims came off from, from. One thing I like about BMW is that all their rims are all interchangeable. You know, like you can get yourself like a 2019 BMW with, with rims and they can fit <laughs> on an old truck like this. So let me go around in the inside and show you guys the inside. I wish I had the black interior, but God lent me to just the beige, so gotta be happy with it. Very clean. Well, I try to keep it clean. Uh, this X5 did come with the sport package. Peep the seats and the steering wheel. Very desired. Um, I did add an aftermarket radio to it. Uh, it looks factory, but it's actually an Android based radio. back very roomy never have a problem getting people back here extremely roomy panoramic roof since I've gotten it has always been down like this <laughs> common BMW problems it does have a um, tailgate this trunk opens two ways this way is one of them and the second way is just pushing this button uh, sorry for the mess um, I'm a little bit of a mechanic <laughs> so I keep all my things at the back push this down Oh, it's also sucked down as well too. What I really liked about the truck was that um, it came down from factory with the tow package. The tow package awesome. I have towed boats, yes. I actually went viral with this truck. <laughs> um, let's see this goes to the back. It's uh, the door. It's the back. Very comfortable. Very clean, yo. If you guys are thinking about getting one of these as a first car, it's 
especially if you're in high school going to college, definitely get yourself an E53 X5 with the 3.0 engine. <laughs> not the 4.4, not the 4.6, not the 4.8. Yes, they're faster, but you get speed, but no reliability. So yeah, I, I'm, I guess you guys are wondering, damn, this thing is clean for 200 and almost 50,000 miles. But yeah, the truck has 250 toes miles on it. Let me show you guys. and 242,837,000 miles. 242,837, yep. Uh, as you can see, there's no check engine lights. Um, the pixels are probably a little bit going out. All right, that's about it. No weird lights on the dash. This car is very well taken care of. I've done pretty much the cooling system since I've gotten the car. Not that it had any issues with it, but when I got it, I was like, might as well do the cooling system. So, things I've done with the truck, valve cover gasket, like I said, the cooling system. Um, I kept it with my oil. I have a K&N air filter here. Um, what else have I done? Um, changed the belts. Like I said, this, this engine is pretty much bulletproof. You don't get a lot of power and speed, but you get reliability with this engine. But, yeah, this truck is super reliable. I just wanted to share it with you guys. Um, every time I tell people how much miles is on this truck, they're always like, what? Because <laughs> I have to take a second look. But yeah, these BMWs are very reliable if you take care of them and you keep up with maintenance. You shouldn't have a problem. So, alright, this concludes the video. Uh, please like and subscribe to the channel. Coming True BMW. Or True BMW per se. Um, uh, let's see, I'm putting the fog lights. Um, please comment and like the video. Um, I do respond to comments. Uh, please positive comments, not negativity. Yeah, I just want to show, show you guys how it looked with the fog lights on. But um, yeah, like and subscribe.